As interest in the upcoming iPhone grows, another exciting development is on the horizon. The brand new M4 devices, particularly for Macs. Today, we'll look at the estimated release dates for the M4 Max and what we can expect this year until 2025. Let's get started. The first product to use the M4 series processor was the iPad Pro, which was released in May. This chip, based on TSMC's new 3 nanometer device, features a 10-core CPU, up from the M1, M2, and M3's 8 cores. The regular M4 configuration has 4 performance cores and 6 efficiency cores, while a bin version with 3 function cores and 6 convenience cores is available in the lower-spec iPad Pro. The 14-inch MacBook Pro is expected to be among the first Macs to include the M4 processor, with a delivery date toward the end of 2024, possibly in late October or early November. This time is similar to last year's Scary Fast event, when Apple debuted the M3 series. The M4 MacBook Pro is expected to arrive with little design modifications, perhaps at a similar event or via a press release. The possibility of a new space black color, as seen on the M3 Pro and M3 Max exists, however, space gray may be retained as an option. The M4 Pro and M4 Max MacBook Pros could be announced at the same event. Apple may follow suit with last year's strategy of releasing the M4, M4 Pro, M4 Max all at once. Another possibility is a separate event in early January, similar to the M2 series debut at the beginning of 2023. This event could include both 14-inch and 16-inch variants of the M4 Pro and M4 Max. The new Mac Mini is following on the list. The Mac Mini is expected to keep its long-standing design, skipping the M3 in favor of the M4 and M4 Pro chipsets. An end of October or early November release appears likely. If there is an event, it may feature the M4 MacBook Pro, M4 Pro Mac Mini, and M4 Mac Mini, with a chance of incorporating the M4 Max as well. Looking ahead, there's a chance we might see a new M4 iMac by the end of 2024, possibly at a similar event to the Scary Fast event of 2023. This would be a notable shift, upgrading the iMac within a year instead of the typical two-year cycle. While design changes are unlikely, a new color option could be introduced. The MacBook Air, on the other hand, is expected to see its M4 upgrade in 2025. The last update in March 2024 introduced the M3 to the 13-inch and 15-inch models. Thus, a March or April 2025 release for the M4 MacBook Air is anticipated, with no major design changes, just the transition from M3 to M4. WVDTC 2025 will most certainly feature the Mac Studio, which will include the M4 Max and M4 Ultra. This event follows a two-year hiatus from the M2 Ultra's launch, skipping the M3 generation. The Mac Studio's release around this period is consistent with past launch patterns. The Mac Pro could debut at WWDC 2025 or later this summer. There is talk of an M4 Extreme chipset, which might combine two M4 Ultras, essentially four M4 Maxes. However, this is only a theoretical possibility. The Mac Pro may simply feature the M4 Ultra. So, what are your thoughts on the M4 devices? Are you planning to buy any? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. For the latest Apple news, reviews, and comparisons, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Until next time, take care and see you soon.